Hey everybody in YouTube land, check this out. Well I figured I'd show you what I was doing here so you can actually see what's going on. I'm, I've been messing around with the table and you know it kept leaving those streaks and, and you know you just got to keep playing with the stuff. And so today, let me show you what's going on here. Right here, as you can see, right there, this line section here. I really don't like that. I like it to where it flows more even across the table. So what I just did is, oh, and another note, see that right there? You guys don't want that. That's natural erosion, I like to call it. So what you do, because you see, you get down in here, let me show you. See what's going on there? It's eating away at my bank. I don't want that, because it could push all my gold and whatnot away. And see that undertow? I don't like that either. So all you got to do, put your hand in there and go swipe, 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 side to side, you're good to go. And if it starts back up, just do the same thing. Swipe it side to side and it takes that undertow away. See? So you always got to pay attention. Right here, just do a little swipe right over and level it back out. Gone. You always want to do that because what will happen is it will push all your gold out from up underneath there with that undertow. See? Here's another one starting up. So I mean, you always just got to watch it, okay? And over here, you see, now I'm getting more of an even distribution of, of material being pushed down. So this is what I like. And all I did, if you remember earlier, this side here was up a little bit higher, so I pushed it down. And then I took the vice grips, okay? And then remember, I, uh, I was talking about, I don't know if I, well, actually, I don't think I, I deleted that video, but because it was too long. Right here, I just crimped it, and because I like to use baleen wire around these tough uh, rubber hoses, you might want to get a softer hose that has more of a, an ability to uh, flex and bend at a natural curve. But I like to take baleen wire on this harder uh, hose and just squeeze it and crimp it tight, and then squeeze it and crimp it tight the other way if I want to increase the flow. So to decrease the flow, I just crimp it tight. To increase the flow, I go the other way and crimp it tight the other way. So. You know, and that's the poor man's methods of prospecting. When you ain't got nothing out in the field, people, and you're way out in the middle of nowhere, but you got some baling wire, that's what you use. Don't travel back into town and get yourself a little little uh, valve, anything like that. Just use some baling wire. Get her done. See, that's what it's all about, people. Poor man's methods of prospecting. When you're out in the field and you got to have something and get something quick, keep in mind these videos, download them on your phone, I'll have an application for you before too long of poor man's methods of applicate. Uh, <laughs> sorry, of poor man's methods of prospecting in an application form to put on your phone, so you can carry me around everywhere you go and check it out out in the field. All right, and I'll even try and do my best to make it to where you can download the videos, compress them down, you know, so they don't take up too much space on your phone, and uh, take me with you wherever you go. So if you got to check something out, bam, poor man's methods of prospecting with Bruce Couch. Get that gold.